everybody, I'm Nitin and today in this PSLE 2016 paper 2 question series, I'll be going through question 9. In my channel, I aim to help all of you master all those concepts out there, okay? So let's jump straight into question 9. So this is question 9, okay? So question 9 is testing us on speed. So let's read the question first. Alice and Huda started jogging from the same point of a 5 km track around a the park. They started at the same time but in opposite directions. Alice jogged past Huda after 2 km. Both of them did not change their speeds throughout. Alice took 40 minutes to complete one round. What was Huda's jogging speed in meters per minute? Okay, now that we have read the question, let's highlight the key information. Okay, so let's highlight it. So Alice and Huda started jogging from the same point of a 5 km track. Okay, they started at the same time but in opposite direction. So this is speed traveling in opposite directions. Alice jogged past Huda after 2 km. So Alice ran 2 km and Huda ran 3 km. So both of them do not change their speeds throughout. So it was the same speed. Alice took 40 minutes to complete one round. What was Huda's jogging speed in meters per minute? So these are the key information. So let's analyze this. So they are the same starting point. Huda ran this way and Alice ran this way. So they met at so Huda ran 3 kilometers and Alice ran 2 kilometers. They met at a point, okay? So now, what we should do is basically find, uh, we should basically take all the 5 kilometers, 2 kilometers. We should change all the kilometers into meters because they are asking the answer in meters per minute. So meters. So that is why we convert um, 5 kilometers into meters. And in order to solve this question, we need to use the DST triangle. So this triangle is basically the speed triangle uh, with all the formulas. So if you want to find speed, is distance over time. If you want to find time, distance over speed. If you want to time this, if you want to find distance, it is speed times time. So it's basically here. All the formulas. Even if you memorize all the formulas, just draw it. Just draw a small triangle so that you can refer to it. In case you forget or in case you make a careless mistake. Okay, so first step is to convert 5 kilometers into meters. So which will give us 5,000 meters. So remember kilometers to meters is times 1,000. Okay, and meters to kilometers is divide by 1,000. So kilometers to meters times 1,000. Meters to kilometers divide by 1,000. Remember that, okay? Now, they started at the same time but in opposite directions. First, we are going to find Alice's speed because Alice took 40 minutes and 5 km track. So we know um, how to find speed, right? Speed is basically distance over time. So we know the distance which is 5 km which is 5000 meters divide by 40 minutes to complete one round. So 40 minutes. So which is equal to 125 meters per minute. So this is not, this is Alice's speed in meters per minute. We know that Alice jogged past Huda at 2 kilometers. That means that Huda jogged 3 kilometers. Okay. So Alice took 2 kilometers, right? She jogged 2 kilometers, right? And she took 16 minutes. How did we find that? So we know that 40 divided by 5 is 1 kilometer. 5 is 5 kilometers. Okay. So 40 divided by 5, we find 1 kilometers time and then we times 2 which will give us 2 kilometers time which will give us 16 minutes. So Alice took 16 minutes to jog 2 kilometers. So 16 minutes. Huda took the same time to run uh, to run 3 kilometers because they met at the same they, they passed each other at 2 kilometers. So they must have run the same time, right? So, um, Hura ran for 16 minutes, 3 kilometers, okay? So, she, dog, she jogged 3 kilometers in 16 minutes. That means Hura is definitely faster than Alice, right? Okay. So, we must convert 
three kilometers in two meters because we only know that at least uh, Hura jog three kilometers. We only know the time for that. So Hura speed in meters per minute is basically three thousand. Uh, is basically distance divided by time, which is three thousand meters divided by sixteen minutes, which will give us one hundred and eighty-seven point five meters per minute. Okay. So this is how you get the answer for this question. And you can also check it by looking at Alice's speed as well. So Alice's speed is 125 meters per minute, while Huda's speed is 187.5 meters. So it, it is definitely faster than Alice's. So you know that your answer should be correct. If it goes anywhere below 125 meters per minute, that means you're already wrong automatically. Okay, so you can check it like that. Uh, if you want to just a quick check okay so i hope you understand my explanation for this question question 9 testing us on speed so thank you and bye bye i'll see you in my next video bye